Good morning, viewers, and welcome to our program. I am Terry Bassi, and I am delighted to have Ms. Shemaya play with us today to talk about developing self confidence. Thank you, Shemaya, for joining us. Thanks a lot for being with me. Please come, let me know about you. My name is Shemaya Okwe, I'm an SS student. I'm a student of St. Paul Comprehensive Secondary School. Thank you so much. Can you give us a background knowledge of what self confidence is all about? Sure. Self confidence is a belief in one's abilities, qualities, and judgment. It is the belief that you have the skills, the knowledge, and the competence to achieve your goals and to succeed in your endeavors. Would you say that clear cut steps an individual can follow to develop self confidence? Yes, there are a lot of strategies to build self confidence. The first strategy for building self confidence is to identify your strengths and features. Okay, can you feel more like that? Please. Okay. Everyone has new talents and abilities, and recognizing and cultivating these strengths is very crucial for building self confidence. By focusing on what you can do, you develop a sense of mastery and competence, which will boost your confidence. Aside identifying your strengths and weaknesses, what other steps would you recommend? Okay, you also have to set goals that are tenable and realistic. You also have to spend on the people who are positive and supportive and it's challenging with yourself. And another very important strategy is to love yourself. That's quite the side view. You seem to be more best in the subject matter. Beyond the steps you have highlighted so far, are there other strategies involved in the looking for happiness? Yes, there's another very important strategy for building self-confidence, which is positive self-talk. Positive self-talk is an act of intentionally speaking to oneself with the main aim of improving one's mood, confidence, and overall well-being. It can take many forms, such as repeating daily affirmations, visualizing success, and praising oneself for accomplishments. Through positive self-talk, we can improve our mental and emotional state, which will boost our confidence. Thank you very much for sharing your thoughts with us. Before we wrap up, is there anything else you'd like to add or any final thoughts you'd like to share with our viewers? Developing self-confidence is a very essential aspect of personal growth and success in life. And it's important to remember that it's a process that takes a lot of time and energy for the rewards and losses. Thank you, Shamaya. It was a pleasure talking to you today. I hope you can have the back of the program again soon. I'll be doing it. Thank you. This is where we draw the focus of the people on the program today. Our focus today was on developing self-confidence, and I hope you've learned a thing about so. Thank you for watching and bye for now.